set. Smiles. <laughs> I don't want to smile. You smile? Okay. In step jumps, five stride jump. Um, back it up. It's probably going to be somewhere around the chalk bowl. I'm not super concerned about accuracy down here. We do full approach stuff. Just make sure you land on that. You are. Um, Should we just take a guess? Hop, you're, you're a hop step jump. So you're the whole thing. Uh, just from a five, five try. None of it. Uh, we do have a picture of you, actually. Yeah, it's not on there. I emailed to the staff. Uh huh. But not not good enough for the Facebook. No. Yeah. Selfie mode. What uh, what are we doing here? We got heart rates. We're doing tempo on a bike today. We take a little pounding off the legs. We hit some max velocity sprint stuff yesterday. Heavy eccentric loading. I'm gonna these, get out. Of, I'm gonna get out of the frame. These bikes tend to be uh, very concentric dominant. Uh, you split the load based off on the legs and the upper body, so we can get some kind of a metabolic effect similar to tempo running, but taking out all pounding on the legs. So. We're scaling the intensity or individualizing it based on heart rate. I want these guys to be at about 75% max heart rate during their work period and then it can come down and we get a look at uh, aerobic fitness in terms of their heart rate recovery. Um, see how well they can, they can, how quickly they can get up to max heart rate, how quickly they recover. Uh, it self scales or auto regulates based off their fatigue level and their fitness so everybody can get an uh, equivalent workout in terms of the intensity uh, and the metabolic effect based off of the heart rate loading, but uh, they don't necessarily have to go at the same pace or the you know, speed on the bike. Uh, what's it feel like to lose? <laughs> You're not even close to winning. You were dead last. It hurts. Yeah. Okay.